Hola, and welcome to another DNC adventure. I just arrived about a half hour ago to the Chano Lake State Park again, where we're going to be camping for one night. Um, but I just wanted to check in. I set up one of our tents as we are going to be camping with some family tonight. Um, and we just invested in a new tent. So stick around and you'll be able to see our brand new tent. It's big. It's awesome. And you get to watch us struggle to put it up, probably. So, I'm just walking back to the site as I explored a little bit to see if there is any good fishing spots, which there are. But the sites here are pretty close together and kind of small, but again, it'll do for one or two nights if you're just looking for somewhere new. Let me flip you around. You can see our green tent way in the distance. But yeah, stick around. Probably won't be showing too, too much, but if we catch some fish, we'll show you. We'll show you dinner, breakfast, as we're gonna be trying yet another new camping recipe to try out. And yeah, stick around and we'll see you soon. Hello, I am back. So we made it to our site together. We have Devin over there. Hi Devin. <clears throat> but I just wanted to show you our cool new tent. Just put it up for the first time and it's huge. So it's a 10 person cabin tent. And the inside is pretty awesome if you don't trip. So the idea behind this tent is that there's partitions that separate it and you can create a screened in porch kind of. And then the other side can be your sleeping area if you so choose. So it's just super easy to put up. Took us, both of us, not even five minutes to get it up, which was pretty nice. Um, but we're about to go do some fishing and relaxing. We just had dinner and we're just going to have a nice chill night. So we'll catch up with you when we're fishing. Hello and good evening. We decided to just do some night searching of wildlife, so we went to the pier and found some fun fishies and a sweet turtle. So enjoy the little short videos we have of that. And this will probably be the last update before bedtime, so we will see you in the morning. On him? Yeah. Maybe go around him. Can go below him. <laughs> He's eating. He's eating? Oh, yeah. Oh. 
That's the same one with his head. Yeah. I think if you can lower the light, it might be better. Yeah. You got a big turn on. Keep following the light. Uh, jet ski fish, jet ski fish. Whee. Another pumpkin seed. Are you the same one? You can also tell well the colors. <laughs> Is that even a fish? It's just giving up. smaller pumpkin seed it's actually a little, a little bit it so was just deeper in the water At least he's fighting. Yeah. He's a little bigger. He's definitely big. Er. Ow, from the colors. Yeah. Again. Why did I actually get a big grass? Can I just tell? There you go. I didn't know you could catch a bass so small. Can you even hold him like a bass? Yeah. Oh my gosh. Bait. <laughs> it's not bad at all. Oh yeah. That's good. Oh. There we go. Come on. Stop it. <laughs> Hook him out. That's a good one. Good morning, everybody. It's another beautiful day. We just went fishing, which you probably already saw. And now we're cooking breakfast of French toast and sausage, which is so delicious. French toast sticks. Um, so we'll catch up with you after breakfast. Hello again. Welcome back. So I didn't show it too much in the morning just because we were kind of relaxing, hanging out with the family, so I didn't get to show too much. Um, just wanted to give a little update about the campground itself. It was, I would give it a 3.5 out of 5 stars. The campsites themselves are pretty good, decent size. We had two big tents, two cars, and we still had room to spare. Um, but they're really close together not a lot of space in between um, like there's no trees or anything like that so that was kind of a bummer um, the other reason why I would rate it so low is we had some really loud neighbors that didn't respect any of the campsite rules they had more than two cars they had more than two tents they had more than four people um, however DNR did come by at about 10 15 and started scolding them about the noise and all that kind of good stuff um, and then when they didn't cooperate after that they came back about half an hour later and stood there until everybody left which was really nice um, and it's good that they were doing the rounds um, but I feel like that was also part of the campground host host's responsibility and they didn't do anything so 
I would, I would say it's an average site, but probably won't return frequently, even though it's super close to us. It's only about a 10 minute drive from our home, so it was nice to just get off of work, come here and enjoy a nice night out, but won't be returning super often. But um, just a nice short video for you guys to enjoy. You got to see our brand new tent. Um, this was the first time that we used it, which was nice. But you'll see more of that guy soon. Um, but if you liked what you saw, please give me a like. Feel free to subscribe to the channel if you have a YouTube account.